Nobody gonna change my life Yeah, I'm still that OG Yeah, I'm still that nice And I'ma do me, uh-huh Till I close my eyes Cause I can see a hater in disguise But me, I keep it moving Yeah, real positive With that good soul And that good knowledge Of course, I keep it going With my raps when I'm flowing I'm the truth, the real And yes, I'm spoken And anything try to stop me Will get broken Cause a brother like me Is not up for the joking so What the f*** is up, world? Y'all already know who it is, man. Music I M T V, man. You know, I I I I I ain't, I ain't just get into this, man. I've been into this, man. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Music I M T V, and also subscribe to the YouTube channel Latino Battle League, and also Music I M T V. But it's not about me tonight. Tonight is about Uptown Live. Yeah, MC backslash MC Battler. It is what it is. Hip hop in the building. I'm about to bring them right in. Waste no time up in this piece. Uptown Live, what's poppin', brother? What's good? Music I am, you know me. Uptown. That's right, all day. Uptown Live, where you originally from? Well, I I was born right here in um in Washington Heights in Manhattan, but I was raised in the Bronx, you know. Right when, when they let me out the hospital, my mom's and my pops got an apartment in the Bronx. And I've been mm. living there ever since. Oh, okay, no doubt, no doubt. So, so you've been out of NY your yeah. whole life. Yeah, Bronx, you know, Kingsbridge, one out six Grand Concourse. Oh, okay, I hear what you're saying, Briex, Nick. You heard. Um, and your Uptown Live, you are a battle rapper, right? You are, you are yeah. an MC backslash battle rapper. You feel what I'm saying, right? Um, you first, yep. Uh, how many? How long? I ain't gonna say how many years. How long you been battling? Well, I just started battling, like, in the summer. I've been rapping since, I, I've been seriously rapping since, like, old time. I was, like, 17. Mm. Yeah. You know, so, I started off kind of late, but, you know, music is music at the end of the day. And once you feel that shit, you just want to write everything down. Right, right. And why, and why, and why got you into wanting to, uh, like, battle rap? Um, You know, me being from the Bronx, like, Every time, um, I went to three different high schools for for um, situations that happened. But each high school I went to, it was there was always a battle going on. You know, I could tell her people hanging on the, you know, that type of shit. It got me pumped, especially being me being a freshman or or sophomore, seeing the older, you know, seniors start rapping to each other and shit. That shit for me, that yeah. shit um, motivated me, and I wanted to do that shit. So that's why I started battle rap. That's what's up, man. What gives you the inspiration and motivation to do what you do in this hip hop community? I'm gonna say the the motivation, the shit that gets me inspired is that Spanish the Spanish story hasn't really been told. Like we've been out in these streets for years and we got so many stories in, in our community or even even the the mainstream, they talk about, you know, popular connect all the time, you know, being a La Marina, all of that shit. So you know, it that motivates me to, to, to tell the story for me. Like it could be it could be more than one too. It don't have to be just one Spanish rapper. It could be a whole bunch of us, you know? Right. There's plenty right, of right. stories that we got. Mm. All right, that's what's up, man. Um if you had a chance to personally battle anybody, who would it be? Mm, that's that's a good one. Um, I, I'm not. I I I don't like to say top tier, mid tier, low tier, cause I don't give. And I'm gonna say it again. I, I don't give two fucks about yeah. none of that shit. All right, cause these top tiers are, are looking like low tiers right now. So, you know, right. just 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 give me one. You know what I'm saying? Who would you personally kill if you had the chance to? You can name a few. Not for, not for nothing. You know, um, I was, you know, talking about that whole Spanish thing and, and, you know, being more than one Spanish rapper to be out there. But I feel like I, I would kill Cortez, you know. 
Like, <laughs> the reason, the reason, the reason why, the reason why, why yeah. is because niggas don't know Spanish, not even a lick, like not even a little bit. Like I want to tell them like why, like you, you know, like I understand niggas grew up in Brooklyn and all that. And shit, but you got to know your culture at the end of the day. Like you got to represent, represent, represent that shit fully. Like niggas cut his ass about being, you know, Mexican, Puerto Rican. Flip that shit on them. You feel me? Flip that shit on them. Well, I'm gonna flip it on you. Right, right, right. That's what's up, Cortez and shit. That's what's up, man. That's definitely. Yeah, but that that nigga nice, you know. He been holding Spanish mm-hmm. niggas down. He was the only one, like you feel for me? For real, for real. So I I give him homage. You feel me? To, to for that, like he was the Pay only homage one. Pay homage where it's due, my G. Exactly. You know, so, um, he put in work. I'm not gonna lie, like. Yeah. Uh huh. Um, Cortez, I'm um, grind time days, my nigga. Yeah, facts. Right. That's one thing we can't take away from Core. Yep. And he's been around mm-hmm. for a long time, and I don't know how people don't look at him. Like, for me in my eye, bro, he, he you know, he a legend. You know what I mean? Anybody that comes yeah. from that grind time yeah. shit, man, from that ever back in the day, man, they straight legends to me, bro. And, you know, right. there's so many ways of legends, you know what I mean? So. Right. That was the I, days where battle rap wasn't popping. You know, oh my and I God, used to be, bro. I used to be on that. Like I used to be on that. Like not for bro, nothing. I... <laughs> those battles are ten times more entertaining than the battles that's out right now. Fact. I'm not gonna lie. Like I'm not gonna lie. You know, there's a couple of killers out here. I'm not gonna lie. The 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 level of battle rap has increased. Is increased crazy. Like the lyricism and all of that. But being entertainment wise, grind time days. That shit was for me. That shit was entertaining. Hell yeah, man. Hey, yo, uh, uh, um, Uptown Live, man, it's, you know, it's, it's an honor definitely to have you on, on you know, for, for this interview. You feel what I'm saying? Definitely. Right. And I appreciate you. You feel what I'm saying? For you actually hitting me up, you know what I mean? Because I ain't Hollywood. I don't care. Anybody hit me up, I'll hit them back. I'll get them on the show. I don't got a problem with that, man. Um, Uptown Live, how you take criticism, bro? I take criticism, you know, like, you know, this. It depends on the criticism because sometimes people will criticize you to, you know, throw a little shot at you. But if I feel the criticism is right, and you know, I take it all the time. Like, you know, I'm I'm new to this battle rap shit, new to music, and I just want to grow in this shit. So, but you ain't new to hip hop. Oh nah. Exactly. Nah, you feel what I'm saying? Yeah. You know. You, you know, know. Once. Go ahead. Go ahead, brother. Um. Nah. That. You know. Some people would. I wouldn't. I appreciate criticism, but the criticism that I don't like is when people like tell you what to do. Like this is what you gotta do. Like nah, like you know if you if you if you um approach yourself like if you're giving an advice, then I would take it. You know I would take it into deep consideration. But if you're telling me that I have to do something, that's, that's nah. Not yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, 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 you know um, telling them to do it. And 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 there's another way how to tell people. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. And, the and, words. It's and, all about and, the words. That's why battle rap is so yeah so effective right now because it's the words. It all it all depends on how you say it. You feel me? How you yeah. word your your sentence, man. Um, right. Uptown Live. What makes you different? <laughs> um, I feel like. I have an original flow. I don't feel like a lot. Of, I don't sound like nobody. A lot of these battle rappers sound alike. I feel like I don't sound like nobody at all. Um, so what else? Um, me being Spanish, of course. That's just, that's that's a definite. Um, yeah. And just me being from the Bronx too. You know, like me being from the Bronx. Like I don't think I would love hip hop this much if I wasn't from the Bronx. Because, you know, hip-hop started out there. Yep. And it's you know crazy. I, mean? I, I just had an interview um, after the Save the City shit, and I was telling I was telling um, the, Rock. Uh, the person that was interviewing me. No, nah, not Rock. Somebody somebody else was interviewing me. And, was it Pete um, Cologne? Nah. It was, uh, oh. it was a female. Oh, okay. All right. No doubt. Yeah. And I was, I was telling her, like, in the Bronx, there's really nobody, it's crazy because there's nobody that we really look up to like that, you feel me? There's nobody that's really popping from the Bronx, and that's sad. Like, if you go to the Bronx right now, it's looking crazy. Like, 
It's looking real crazy. People people that's getting evicted out of Manhattan is going to the Bronx. So you feel me? The Bronx is, is is crazy right now, and there's nobody that we look up to at all. And that shit boggles my mind all the time. Like this is where it started at. Yeah, you trying to make something happen and shit. I hear you, bro. That's what's yeah. up. Yeah. Yo, Not only me. But yeah. Uh-huh. What was your last? What was your last battle? My last battle was acapella battle. It was two weeks ago, and um, then I did the safe for safe. Was it on We Go Hard? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Salute the We Go Hard TV man. Definitely, them dudes uh-huh. putting in work. Your boy clipping on them. That's a fact. You know, in B City and shit. I thought, you know what I mean. Um, let me see. You got anything new coming up? Any new battles? Acapella battle. Yeah, that- yeah, that battle should be coming out in a couple of weeks. Is versus Ace the Great. It's a one rounder. The next, the next battle. Oh, okay. So Ace rounds. the Great, man. I need to get him too, man. Boricua Bull, right? Mm-hmm. I uh-huh. think so. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, but, I, 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 I think he is too. I think he is Spanish and shit. What well, was uh, not talking with him, but me and him chatted like one or two times and shit. Yeah. <laughs> nah, but that battle, that battle was crazy, you know. Um. You gonna see like the the footage is gonna be crazy. Man. It's really That's gonna be crazy. I don't wanna I don't wanna you know uh, give it away or whatever, but it's gonna be it's gonna be crazy. I hear you, bro. Um, name five battle leagues that you watch without without mentioning URL and KOTD. Um, Gorilla Warfare. Mhm. Uh, we go hard, of course. Right. Trap, trap house, and why? Right. Um. Mm. Oh, spit, spit that heat. Mm-hmm. Spit that basura. You already know them niggas. Niggas is gonna die. We go hard all day. Um. Who else? Damn. One more. One more. Um. And my dad can't think of another one though. You oh, watch Ahab? Queen, Queen of the Ring. Oh, all right. Say no more. Say no more. All oh, right. Ahab too. Los Vegas boys, right? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Uh, RBE. You fuck with RBE? Oh, RBE. Yeah, I'll be forgetting. Uh huh. It's it's, it's 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 a few, man. But but that's what's up, man. At least you know. At least I know. You know because. At least I know, you know, what battles you watch, you know, what battle leagues, you know, you watch. Yeah, and I'm sure I'm, you I'm know you tune. watch a few. Yeah, I'm in tune. I'm in tune with the with the battle rap shit, but Cause, cause like that's lately, the, yeah. lately that lately that I've been battle rapping, I really don't feel like watching like no battles. Like, I really because mm. sometimes like battle rappers, they gotta understand, you know, sometimes when you watching these niggas battle and. You know, some of them niggas do inspire you. When you trying to write for you for your opponent, sometimes you might take a nigga ball without even noticing. And that's why I don't even want to watch no battles because I'm not trying to have that. Like, and that's what that's a lot of mistakes these niggas do is that they watch all these battles and then when they're thinking of, of, of some balls for their opponent, you know, mistakenly, you know, they don't know they're doing it, but they 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 bite off of other niggas. So they be right. watching battle rap all day. Mm. Yo, yo, uh, Uptown Live. Who, who, who was your toughest opponent? Oh, uh, my toughest opponent. I haven't had too many battles, but I would say myself because I be battling myself all the time. I got a hundred thousand Uptown Live name for it. You know. Mm. But it's, well, I'm still I'm still young in the game though, so I want some competition. That's what's up, man. You know. Um, what was the best battle you watched lately? Hmm. Um, I still be watching that Charlie Cuz with Daylight shit crazy still to this day. Like that's I that's like, really I, classic. I, I like that battle. Yeah. That's what's up. That's what's up. Daylight and Charlie, okay. Let me find out. Um do you associate with the fans, bro? Oh, of course, you got to. You got to. You got to associate with the fans. You know, anybody that's showing love, support, anything, you got to 
support them back, you know. This right. world revolves around karma all the time, so, you know, if you give bad energy, you won't receive bad energy. Mm. Right. Do fans overhype some battles? Oh, of course. <laughs> yeah, that's, it, it comes It comes to the territory of, of battle rap, you know. You won't have them diehard fans that's going to ride out. It's not even only in battle rap, it's, you know, in music, period, you know. Fans be die hard if you say something about one of these mainstream, you know, people is a uh, hundred thousand fans about to cut your neck off on Twitter. You prefer big stage or small room? Battle. I pref- right now, since I'm coming up, I prefer small room because I feel like, you know, it, it catches the essence. You know what I'm saying? It catches the essence of me starting off me being hungry. So I'd rather a, a small stage. No. Right, right. All right. Now, you just went off to uh, Cypher City TV, uh, Battle on the Beat. Salute the Rock the Hustler. Salute the Boss Man 155. Salute the Picolon. Salute the whole family over there. That, that's family. Bronx all day. Right, right. Now, you just did it, uh, Battle on the Beat, right? Yeah. Uh, um,. How was it? How did it go? You know, um, and how, how 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 did that come about? Um, well, all right, so how it came about is, you know, I hit Cypher City up because I seen, you know, what they was doing. I, I always see the grind. You feel me? When, it's, when something is original, I want to be a part of it. And that shit is original for real. So I hit up, you know, Rock. I hit up Rock. Oh, no. I hit up Cypher City. Then um then Cypher City licked me up with Rock and Rock, you know. It was a, we only had a week too. So it's a right for this shit. I'm pretty sure the other dudes had a couple like a month or two. So yeah. Right, but me me and, and and the boy that I faced, uh shout out to Mur Maury Hayes, you know. We um we only had a week to write, so but yeah, that's how that's how it, it happened then. When I come to this shit, um, it was the first battle up. They had like a little cipher in the beginning. And then mm-hmm. it was me and him. So we go. And, you know, he did his thing. But I came with it. Like, <laughs> I bodied right. that beat for real. That's you what's up. You when it comes out. Like, I really bodied that beat for real. What you think about Cypher City TV, bro? I think that shit is. It's popping. Like I'm, I'm, I'm really gonna start linking up with these dudes. Cause they, they really grinding yeah. out here, and they, they original with they shit. Like I don't, I don't see people doing this, and I like it. Like I like originality. I like that they from the Bronx. You know, I love that they from the Bronx. You know. No, and plus they got a, they, they, you know, they got a, a few platforms going on over there too. Yeah. You know, they, they, they got bars, a, the ciphers, the, the interviews. Yeah, yeah. I want to be part of all of that. And and they definitely um put put um putting in that work, man. You know, cause we definitely need that essence. You know, yeah, we definitely do, do man. Um, do. you know, I know you wanted to ask me a few questions and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? I definitely wouldn't mind, you know, answering them. You know what I mean? So you know, let's 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 chop that fable up. Alright. Oh. Um, you know. Hold on, give me a second. Yo. Yo. So, my fault, bro. Alright, so, um, let's see. Would you ever battle rap? Would I ever battle rap? Yeah. If I, if... Well, I'm not going to say if I get thrown into the wolves. If a wolf holla at me, I'm going to holla back. Mm-hmm. Like that. Right. Now, how do you think you, you'll do? Uh, well, I'm very word wordplay minded, so I think I'll definitely do great. You know what I mean? I'll probably, I'll, I, 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 I'm, 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 I'm going to do a prediction right now. I'll probably get them 2-1. 
Mm-hmm. You know, I'll give him a round. I'll give him a round. Give him a round. Oh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, shit. Uh, all right. Um, let's see. Would you prefer um, recording or, or battling? Like being in the studio. Or would you prefer uh, just, you uh, know, what, what I prefer doing whatever. music than to battle rap if yeah. I had a chance if I had a chance to battle rap well actually it it all you know it all depend on on what passion I want to go for you know what I mean if I love my music I'm going to probably be more with my music but if I love the platform of battle rap I probably will go with the platform of battle rap but I prefer just doing my music and then, you know, doing a couple battles, and I wouldn't mind doing that. But I prefer to keeping up with my music to uh, to keep the uh, the MC part of me going all the time, you know what I mean? Like, to keep myself steady. I always keep work out there with my music. That's one thing, you know, with the battle rappers, um, some don't, don't got music out there, you know, and some do. And I feel like that's yeah. what needs to be done more. You know, battle rappers need to do music more, you know, and right. stuff like that. Right. Take a take a time, take a day or something or two to do one one track, you know what I mean? And, yeah. You know. All right, so um, remember how in that blog you was talking about um, industry rappers coming into battle and shit like that? You know, I, I agree with you. I don't feel like, you know, these niggas should come to, to battle rap at all. I feel like battle rap is a is an artist. You know, it's starting to become an artist development. You know, something that the industry lacks is, is creating artists. And I feel like battle rap could do that if niggas be more in tune with the music. But anyways, I wanted to know, you wouldn't want to see those Big Daddy Kane versus Rock Ken, though? Nope, nope. Nah? I, 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 you know, well, let's, you know, me, I always say, I come from that ever back then, you know, L L Cool J, you know, yeah. With cannabis, you know, it, it was a bunch, you know, uh, it, it was so many of them, you know, um, the Juice Crew and all of them, Marley Ma and all of them, you know, Mellow Ice and all, you know, yeah. like, like, I come from that era, you, you feel me, and, and, and honestly, that's what it was most of the time, it was like MCs battling each other on track, Yeah, you feel me, you know, it, it, it's, it's like... MCs battling each other on track, and all. And one one thing is with me. I don't want to see. No, no, I don't. I, I honestly, I, honestly, honestly, I don't want to see them because you know why. Yeah. Be tuned in. Be tuned in. Give, give, give some. Give, give these battle rappers that are battle rappers. Okay, I know they might have came from that era. You know what I'm saying? If we talk about those, 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 those guys, those MCs from back in the days, you know, it, it's like pay homage, bro, because yeah. there's people, there's people in this battle rap that don't want to really see that. You know what I'm saying? Industry cats coming in here and, and, and getting thirty thousand, forty thousand, fifty thousand, a hundred thousand, and getting all this money, while 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 the battle rapper that been here. <laughs> for God knows for how long, only getting probably half of that. You feel what I'm saying? So why, why, why not give one of y'all battle rappers a chance and give y'all the check when knowing that y'all gonna put in the classic? And another thing, most of these mainstream artists do didn't didn't never put in. They they none of them came in with a hundred percent. All right, not Cassidy, not Mr. Right. Fab. N- not not Joe Button and especially not cannabis. Right. <laughs> you feel me? And I feel like you battle rappers uh, uh um give it y'all y'all all. You know what I mean? Y'all give yeah. it a hundred a uh, hundred and ten percent. Yeah. You feel me? So I, I I'm not I don't care if they come in because eventually they're gonna wind up coming in. But yeah, yeah. I, I I give two shits because I I am a fan to battle rappers. Battle rappers, get it? Battle rappers, not battle rap. I'm a fan of battle rappers. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm going to always be a fan of battle rap. But battle rappers, you know, that been here for so long and deserve that chance, why are they not yeah. getting that chance? Why all of a sudden an industry cat come out of nowhere, get all these thousands, mm-hmm. and and then they don't even talk about rap. I mean, battle rap. Right. It's nothing yeah, against that's, them. That's something I, I, I don't understand. There's a lot of them. 
that's starting to come out and be like, yo, I fuck with battle rap, this and that and the four, but out of nowhere, but it's not do because I know these niggas be watching just like we be watching crazy. Yeah, yeah, time. yeah, but I, yeah, but all of a sudden, out of nowhere. Word. Oh yeah, oh man, battle rap is the shit now, man. Yeah, yeah, I'm tuned Word. into battle rap. Now all of a sudden, uh, 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 uh you know, salute the Vlad TV. He, he, uh, yeah. mo, mo, most of the industry cats now that he's in, they, 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 that he interviews, if he does throw in the question about battle rap, they be like, yeah, I watch battle rap. <laughs> and would oh yeah, man, I, I'll get such man. They give me such and such, man. I'll definitely yeah, I'll battle. You better man, stay where you at. Right. You see the first thing he said? If they give me such and such. Is it about the money all the time? Yeah, it's really not, though. But niggas is doing it for free out here. You feel what I'm saying? Y'all battle rappers deserve a check. What, what, what's, what's up with these all washed up or new mainstream rappers just coming in out of nowhere? Right. And getting these checks, and then and then, and then then what they do is they don't put, like I said, they don't put in 110%, and then they just leave... And that's it. Then you see them in an the interview. Yeah, I'll battle again for another, you know, 50000 There you go again. Yeah. Is it for the money or is it for the sports? I understand right. you got to feed your family. I understand you got to feed your family because everybody got to feed their family. Everybody got to live. But where's yeah. the essence of the passion that you do it for the, for, the, for, for the love of it? You know what I'm saying? Where's the passion yeah. at? Where, where's that passion at? Yeah, that's, that's, that's crazy because I feel like I don't know what will be wrong with these niggas because if I get a check for anything that I'll do, like I'm putting a thousand, like I'm making sure. Like, could you I'm imagine going getting thirty? Bro, uptown live getting thirty thousand. Oh, I'm going. I'm going bananas. Like, yo, you bananas. You like, probably gonna go bananas. You gonna probably come up in there with a, with all kind of uh 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 uh, uh space bars. It's crazy. Like, I really would go like. I would not sleep at all. Like you understand, thirty thousand. Like, I, and that's what some of these, you know, some of them be getting. And like, I know Mr. Fat just got that. You can't tell, but you can't tell they getting paid thirty thousand. Like you could probably tell by the way, what they rocking and shit, but they bars, it don't match up. Like, they, if yo, I man, they bars don't be, match the price, man. They bars yeah, don't match. Yo, price. yo, yo. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm doing. I'm definitely doing this with you. They bars don't match the check, man. If they bars don't match the check, man, get yo, man, give that check to somebody that deserve it. Exactly, like fuck a name, like come on, nigga name, like I'm pretty sure my whole hood. If if Smack ever give me thirty thousand dollars, the oh whole Bronx God. is gonna be there. The whole Bronx is gonna be there. Like I guarantee that niggas is gonna pay. Uh, I don't know how much Smack Smack be. Um, I'm charging the tickets for probably like a hundred. I don't know, but. I'm pretty sure all them, everybody's going to pay. Like, I'm going to make sure. Like, I'm going to be out in these streets telling everybody about it that they got to come if I get paid 300000 And then on top of that, I'm going to be writing bars forever. Like, right, oh, right. Man. And I mean, I mean, I mean, that's the, that's why, that's why, you know, I'm against that mainstream shit. You know what I'm saying? Because there's battle Absolutely. rappers. This is the point that I'm making. There's battle yeah. rappers out here that are much more hungrier than they are. Yeah. And they deserve a chance more than the mainstream. The mainstream right. comes, get their check, and leave. Yep. They don't talk about battle rap like 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 the battle rapper that like battle rappers that are out there really hungry and doing this. Yeah, like this shit is like I, not for nothing. I'm not gonna lie. I love music. You know, I, I would love to perform, go around the world, go around the world, and and, and perform my music. But you know. That shit is easier than than having to battle. Like mm-hmm. I'm that shit is easy. Like I, if I if I have a, if I had an opportunity of having a studio in my house twenty four seven, I'm pretty sure. No, I know for a fact that the music that's gonna come out that shit is gonna be potent. You know, but mm-hmm. now I gotta work with my utensils. I'm from New York. You know, I don't got a studio. You feel me? Right. So I I, I gotta I gotta battle rap. And that's what I was saying. Like, is this should the battle rap should just become artist development, like you know, because it is developing artists for real. All they have to do is make more music, and it's gonna be lit for a lot of us. You know, mm-hmm. people just gotta make a little bit more music and stop getting, you know, you know they. I understand making your 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 um your life battle rap this and that and the fourth, but 
you gotta turn you gotta turn that shit to a positive, my nigga. Like I ain't trying to be fucking focused on niggas cutting niggas ass all day. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we're worried about the the next MC, you know, yeah. at, at, for that whole entire period when you could be working on some damn music or something, yeah. man. In three months, yeah. talking about talking about you ain't do no music in three months, but you wrote. And and rehearse and did this for three months for this yeah. one person. What did you do for the yeah. three months? Like you didn't drop a track exactly. a month. Exactly. You ain't even dropped exactly. not one track. Are you serious? Exactly. That's 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 the shit about battle. That's the that's the real negative part about battle rap is that you they me? forget they hip hop. That's what it is. Yeah, I think they battle rappers forget they that that. Yeah. That battle rap is hip hop. You know, like battle rap don't come with exactly. music. It just comes with the battler. I understand, you feel me, that, you know, we under, a lot of us is underground artists, you feel me, and um, and we don't have that, you know, that, that big stage, whatever, but we got to understand that, just like you said, this is hip-hop, like, it, it all starts from music, like, you can't forget the music, you can't, like, I understand, you feel me, you, you hungry, I'm hungry too, you feel me, I don't got a, I don't got a studio I can go to, so, this is what I gotta do. I gotta kill niggas so I can get my my name out there to to provide to open up more doors for me. You feel me? And that's what I'm mm-hmm. using this shit for. A lot of these niggas they want to do this shit forever. Nah, like I'm not I'm not trying to battle rap niggas forever. It's entertaining. Mm-hmm. I'm not gonna lie. Like this shit is crazy entertaining. It is. But for me, I wanna I wanna use this d- battle rap and what battle rap gave me and me being a fan as a stepping stone so I could grow. Right. That's what's up, man. That's definitely good to know, man, you know. That's, you know, that's how I feel, you know what I mean? I definitely feel that way because it's not it's not cool, man. It's not cool. You know, give the battle rappers that have been here for a long time, yeah, you know, give, but then you know, give them a you, chance, you know. If a nigga give me a check for this battle rap shit, I'm definitely I, like, no, Bro, bro, listen, oh, it man. all pays off at the end of the day, Uptown Live. Yeah. You just gotta keep it moving, keep it going. That's it, you know. Um, you 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 gotta keep you gotta keep that motivation, keep that and and, and that 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 focus Fire. on you. You know what I mean? Yeah. Keep that faith, man. No no matter what, you feel me? What's up, man? You got any other questions, man? Cause you know that was you know I I really appreciated this, you know, cause I ain't never had an interview where the artist actually hit me back, you know, with some questions. Yeah, and you know, uh, I like information from 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 people, you know, that that got a couple of years on me, you know, like right. it's all about information. Like I told you in the, in the beginning of the interview, so you know, this That's this for me, this for me right here. You feel me? Everything you drop the jewels on me. You feel me? Yeah, so yeah. I learned appreciate it. that. Uh huh. And I and I and I appreciate you for taking he and listen, you know, because right. you know, I I I just I just try to keep. A door open and stay humble, you know. Keep a door yeah. open and stay humble, man. You know, that's 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 all I do. You know, I keep to myself. You know, um, I, I don't be JoJo and Dick Rod, none of that shit. You know what I mean? Like I fuck with everybody. So at the yeah. end of the day, you know, I just I just love what I do. You feel what I'm saying? And I really appreciate yeah. all you got. Every all, every each and everybody I interview, everybody that I talk to, you know, I'm inspired by. My surroundings. That's me. I'm a, I, I'm the dude that's inspired by my surrounding. That's all right. it is. You know, my is motivation. You know, everything you know. is motivation. I use everything for motivation. You know. That's right, man. And your uptown live, man. Um. Any any uh shout outs? Um, I want to shout out TAC. You know, the whole Bronx. Uh, seven hundred. The gang. We almighty takes up. No shout out to my Brooklyn niggas. Um, you know, that's about it. Oh, free free Marudo, free Blinky, you know, rest in peace, e- easy, e- easy, Bronx legend, you know, uh free soga. You know, I'm here, you know, uptown. You know, nah, man, that's for shout sure, man. You know I am shout out to music <laughs> I am, you know. That dude oh. right there, he making moves, he's grinding out here, you know what time it is. Uh huh, all day, man. Listen, man, I got I got a uh 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 a guest on the line and shit, A hat. You know, I gotta say A hat, you know what I mean? It, it all day he from A hat, Las Vegas, man. He's a he's a he's a hell of a artist. 
and shit. He okay. battle raps to the Jones is his name. You know, he's an artist that I work with. Me and him partner up on a lot of shows, and we do recaps and prediction and stuff like that. He's young too, you know, and stuff like that. And um, his pops been doing music since like the eighties and shit like that. Oh, you that's know, crazy. Yeah, yeah. So he know, you know, he does he he, he does beats, he does everything, you know. So he's a good artist, you know. Um, I'm gonna bring him in. Maybe he got a question for you or some inspiring words or something like that for you. You feel what I'm saying? I'm gonna let him come in and get to talk with you for a little bit. You don't mind, right? All right, but no doubt, of course not. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. The Jones. What's good with it? <laughs> you already know, man. I'm here with Uptown Live, man. You know he had a few Double battles on week. We go hard TV. You know what I mean? Y'all can introduce yourselves. You know. Hey, what's going on with it, brother? What's good? What's good? Ah, uh, man, man, just cool and bag, man. I was listening to the interview and shit. Word. You got any inspiring words, the Jones man, for brother? Man, it's like shit. It's like your league. He's going hard, man. <laughs> Facts. Right. 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 Mm. You already know, man. I had to get the Jones right quick. You know what I mean? Um, definitely come in and get some inspiring words here and there. You know, and, you know, a little something, something. But um, Uptown Live, I really appreciate you, bro. Facts, man. You need any Yo, interviews or, or whatever. Bro, holla at me. Just, just, no, I'm just hitting ho- you up first, man. Yeah, hit no. me up. A- a- any discussion you got, anything, you know what I'm saying? A- a- anything that you got, any opinions you want to set out, you know what I mean? Just hit me up. You know, right. you know, one, two, three. You know how it is, man. Uh-huh. You know, a- a- any more shout outs? You know what I mean? Just in yeah. case, you know what I mean? Because, you know, I don't want oh, to get off. Shout out to my twin brother, you know? Shout out to all the females across the world. You know, you got to shout them out. You know, right. That's about it. Let them know where they can this. find you at. Let them know where they can find you at on, on Twitter and Instagram and all that. On Twitter and Instagram is Uptown Live, double E at the end. You know who it is. It's Uptown Live, baby. We go hard. And well, you already shout know what it is. Shout out to me. Yeah. I am, though, man. Again. <laughs> you know, I see you the ground, know. brother. All day, man. You know, I see your grind too, man. Much respect and salute to you. And keep doing what you're doing. You know what I mean? Just keep working. Keep that motivation in you all the time. Remember, motivation, man. And one thing I got to tell the world is, man, yo, if your bars don't go with that check, they don't deserve that check, man. So get it right. You feel me? Get that to me. I'm telling Word up, man. Just um, just give me a minute. You know what I'm saying? It's definitely um, like I said, man. Just give me a minute, real quick. I'm seeing calls calling from everywhere. The Jones, I'm gonna kill you, bro. <laughs> I'm I, I, I'm gonna kill you because I'm about to. Uh, nah, it's all right. They they, you know, they could come in and stuff. All right, let me just finish this off, uh, real quick. Y'all already know, man. Y'all rocking out with music on MTV, and don't forget to subscribe to Latino Battle League. Please subscribe to Latino Battle League and also subscribe to Music on MTV. And don't forget to follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Music on MTV. And we out this piece, Uptown Live. You already know. Stay up, my brother. You too, bro. All right, the Jones. All right, let me yeah. bring in the Utah. Let me bring it because I got a call from Utah, but what I'm going to do is, well... Let me just, because I got to cut this one off and then start up uh, uh, another one, okay? Oh, yeah, I don't know what it is in Utah. Yeah, somebody, oh, man, he just hung up. What the fuck? Anyway, let me shut this down and, and reopen it, uh, a new one, all right? All right, for sure, yeah, I'm um, hit my boys up. So yeah, start home. hitting them up. Somebody called and shit, Utah, but when, right when I went to unmute, when I muted them, the motherfucker hung up, so, all right, bro. All right, hold on. Let me uh, hit him up.
Nobody gonna change my life. Yeah, I'm still that OG. Yeah, I'm still that nice. And I'ma do me, uh huh, till I close my eyes. Cause I can see a hate up in disguise. But me, I keep it moving. Yeah, real positive with that good soul and that good knowledge. Of course, I keep it going with my raps when I'm flowing. I'm the truth, the real. And yes, I'm spoken. And anything try to stop me will get broken. Cause a brother like me is not up for the joking. So